Hey guys, welcome to another video from My Time Outdoors. Scott here again. So, today we're uh, up hiking on the Gunflint Trail. It is the tail end of November, and a lot more snow on the ground. Weird thing. We've got open water right there. Most of the, this lake is wide open. So, going to take a hiking trail that's right over here. Squirrel tracks. Looks like maybe some snowshoe hare tracks. Using our little highway here. So this is rated as a fairly easy trail. But with all of the snow, and yep, this is a rabbit trap, tracks. So expect to see a lot of them. Maybe we'll see a snowshoe hair rabbit. If not, I will put a photo of one that I captured a few days ago up on the screen. And I'm wearing cleats right now. Little sun. All right, so our friendly grouse just kind of cycled around again, going back towards the lake. Wait, there's two grouse. I don't know if you guys can see it, but over by the lake. Oh, I wish I had my gun right now. I'm assuming the trail goes that way, but... Let's see what's over here. I think I want to try to fish this lake this summer. Hmm, this looks like oh, campsite. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Opening, another bigger opening. Oof, we got that big dead one. That really needs to come down. <laughs> that guy, that big dead birch. Got an opening there. And where I did the intro was a boat ramp. Okay, like a little dead sh stuff. 
Oh, this view. Oh. Trail. Probably goes down where I could put my boat. Oh. So here we have some beaver chew. If you look carefully, you can see the grain where the marks have been bitten into. They look like little ribbings. Let's just go right here. Right there. Those little lines that you're seeing are the beaver chew. Right here is the slide for the beaver. You can see where he's come in. And if you look at the ice, there's a couple of little bubble, like broken trails. One going right out here, another right there, where he breaks in and out, or she, it. Great view too. I'm not sure if you got that because my camera is going in and out with the cold. So we're walking up of a beaver slide that goes up here. You can kind of see where he comes up in here. He's been kind of working around in here. And then, oh, you got plenty of fresh chew. Right here. This is cool. This would have been in the last few days. They'll eat these soft birch, poplar, aspen. Yeah. Little crick. That's an old, big old cedar that fell this summer. Man, that's an old tree. I mean, there's another big old cedar. These have never been touched by humans. Well, logged.
snowshoe hair tracks. Oh, never mind that gun. It's hunting season. It's a uh, rough grouse and deer season. The amount of fire you can light with that is. And you can see we're in here. The spiders make their nests inside. That is the end of this video. So, did a bit of a short hike, about halfway up the lake shore. There's some signs missing on a trail. So, didn't get to where I wanted. But, I am happy ending with this kind of a background nonetheless. Crystal clear water, end of November, almost December. All the other lakes are frozen, except for a few of these deep, cold deep water lakes. Almost no snow. This is totally worth it. Until the next time, wish you guys the best. Enjoy your time outdoors.